With a special coverage, this is 3M Newswire. My name is Andrew P. Howard, a North Korean man. Mr. Zon Chong Nam, a former North Korean army officer, will face public execution for simply being a Christian. Of the worldwide Alpha Y International Ministry fails to free him in time. Please pray for Song Chung Nam and his family in North Korea. The international efforts to free Mr. Song Chung Nam are supported also by politicians in the United States of America and Europe. On July 7, 2007, Senator Sam Brownback wrote a letter to the U.S. Secretary Dr. Condoleezza Rice. His message, we would like to bring to your attention the case of Mr. Chung Nam Son, a North Korean refugee who was recently deported back to North Korea. Mr. Son fled to China in 1998 with his wife, son and brother in an attempt to seek refuge in China. Subsequently, in 2001, Mr. Sun was arrested by Chinese authorities and sent back to North Korea, where he faced imprisonment for three years for working to send missionaries into North Korea. Upon his release from prison, Mr. Sun fled to China once again, hoping to find his brother. In January 2006, he was again deported back to North Korea and has remained in prison ever since, where he awaits public execution for being a Christian. Future cooperation and engagement with North Korea will be far more challenging if its leaders continue to persecute their own people for religious views. The United States has made political and religious freedoms important elements in its diplomatic relations, and we are gravely concerned about abuses of such basic rights in North Korea. In the light of these concerns, we respectfully ask you that you seek the release of Mr. Sun. Sun Chung Hoon who is visiting the United States from his home in South Korea today pleaded with the world to pressure North Korea to release his elder brother awaiting public execution for the crime of simply being a Christian. For more than a year, Sun Chung Nam, a former North Korean army officer turned underground evangelist, has been beaten, tortured and held in a bleak North Korean death row basement jail in this capital city. He has been sentenced to public execution as an example to the North Korean people. My only purpose in life right now is to save my brother, the younger son said. I pray to God for my brother's safety. Zhang Chung Hoon made a plea at a news conference at the National Press Club today on July 12th. VOM, an international organization that assists persecuted Christians around the world, launched a global campaign Tuesday calling on people in the United States and other countries to write letters and send emails to North Korean United Nations and U.S. State Department officials on Zon Chong Nam's behalf. VOM is directing people to go to its website on www.brisnerallot.com where we can compose a personal letter of support and encouragement to Mr. Sun. The letter is to be mailed to the North Korean delegation to the United Nations along with a cover letter asking the North Korean government to spare Mr. Sun's life. Release him from prison immediately, report on his current status and deliver the personal letter to Mr. Sun. We are asking for prayers for Mr. Sun but also that people around the world take action on his behalf, said Todd Nettleton, Director of Media Development for VOM. Jesus said, ministering to a prisoner was like ministering to himself. Every letter and email can make a difference. This was a special coverage of 3 Newswire.org. My name is Andrew P. Howard.